Almost there, Flo. Be careful, little owner. We did it, friends. Be careful. The branch is beginning to break. I don't want to look. I don't want to look. Oh, here, take the friendship's heart. Oh, oh! You're so generous, Flo. Even in dangerous moments, you first think of the friendship's heart before your very life. Oh. Oh! I won't let you fall. Leave me, magic. It's too dangerous. Come on, oh. don't give up. Oh. All right, you're oh. almost there. Oh. oh. Gee, you almost gave me a heart attack. Thanks, friends. If it wasn't for you guys, I'd have fallen down there as and well. If it hadn't been for you, we never would have gotten the magic drop. The most exhausting drop in history. Now let's go. Our mission has only just begun. Soon I will take away the other half of the diamond from that little brat. There will be trouble. Well then, any news? Flo and the others have just recovered a magic drop down at the rapids, and they're coming here. Perfect. The trap that we prepared is ready to um. greet them. There'll be no escape this time. They'll get theirs, all right. Is the pig farm very far from here? Don't worry, we're almost there. Listen, Flo, can I ask you an important question? How is the search for Princess Amy going? We looked in all of the three train stations, but unfortunately, there was no trace. It's just a matter of time. The big city is enormous, but not infinite. That's right. We will find the princess sooner or later. Fantastic. The important thing is to never give up. That is, if it's not too late already. Well, don't say that, Balloon. Come on. Sorry, my emotions got the best of me. We can't afford to let our emotions affect us now. Anyway, Magic was right. The big city is not infinite. And we will look for the princess in every corner. And while we were looking for the princess, we found the pigs. And look, there they are. <laughs> it's going to be difficult to know which little piglet is the right one for Steven. Don't look at me. I can't tell them apart. They all look the same. Yeah, me neither. Do it now! Incoming mud! I can never trust the two of them. You! Get out there and help them. I'm going, I'm going! Watch out! Oh, it's a trap! For all the puppies in Pocketville! Get out of my way! You get out of the way! Huh? Hey, what happened? Hmm. Try and guess who's behind this little trick. Ema, it's always her. You'll pay for this. Sooner or later, I will have the friendship's heart. That is a promise. Yeah! If Eva was behind this trick, look who's under it. Hey, get me out of here! Let us both go! Just stop with me first! Leaving them like this wouldn't be very nice at all. Don't worry, Flo. They can free themselves just fine. <laughs> Bless when there isn't a pig coming through! <laughs> it looks like it's gonna be another one of those days. <laughs> How are we going to find the right piglet now? Quite the contrary. Look over there. <laughs> Hello, my name is Flo, and this is Magic. What's your name, little piglet? I'm Lindo. But don't you like playing in the mud like all the other little piglets? Are you kidding? Getting all dirty from hoof to ear? Well, no, I really don't think so. I thought that you piglets really liked playing in the mud. We're not all the same. Every pig has his own way. Well said.
said, Lindo. It just so happens that I have a proposition for you. Oh, grand. Don't tell me that you want to send me... Go ahead, little owner. By the power of the friendship's heart, please bring life to this puppy, that the puppy may bring happiness and joy and companionship to their new little owner and live happily ever after. This game is boring as well. <gasps> hey! A little pig! I've always wanted a piglet just like you! <laughs> How about a race to the end of the block? <laughs> I'm gonna get you! <laughs> Here I come! <laughs> Steven, stop right there! You're not bringing that pig onto the patio! <laughs> I have no idea where that pig came from, but don't worry, I'll take him away right now. Uh, no! What? What's up? That's the first time Stephen wipes his feet before entering the house. And it was that piglet that taught him. I've never seen anything like it. Well, then what do you want to do about him? <laughs> Come here! Come here! <laughs> I've never seen Stephen so happy. Let's just see what life is like with the piglet around the house. that were there last time have all disappeared. Incredible! It's a strange sign. What do you mean? Maybe... Maybe the puzzle has some kind of time signal. What do you mean? It could indicate a place only for as long as the princess is there. Naturally, it's just a theory of mine. A theory that has some logic in it? If that's right, the princess is no longer near a bus station. Then where could she be? Unfortunately, I don't know, Chiro. I don't think that this is really necessary. Come on, get in. A nice hot bath is very relaxing. Exactly. You deserve it. I'll let you have it. You don't want to make me throw you in, do you? It's a little hot. Better if I wait for it to cool down a little bit. No, the water is perfect, Magic. All right, I'll get in. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Magic. <laughs> you see how fun it is? It's not so bad now, is it? Well, that's because you're in here with me. That's why it's fun. Those nice words won't save you from a nice soaping. We'll make you nice and clean. <laughs> oh, magic. I don't like this place during the day, let alone at night. Well, it's better than being in all that mud. Stop your sniveling. We're here. Uh, mm. uh, are you really sure that Dorelia's hideout is here? <laughs> Maybe it's not such a good idea for all of us to go in there. Uh, I, I could stay back here and... and Come on, don't be such a scaredy cat all the time, you wimp. Well, you're the scaredy cat, you know. There's no one here. She must have gone out. I said we'd come back another time. Sterilia! I kept my promise. I came here to see if you are going to keep yours. The 
are never alone. Wait a minute. First, you have to tell me how to send one of my guards to the big city. That was your promise, you remember? Of course I do. Don't you trust me? No, but don't take it personal. <laughs> I never trusted anyone. There is only one way, the ritual of unfriendliness, an ancient ritual that only I know how to do. We're ready to do it immediately. What do we have to do? Nothing is too difficult. Mm -hmm. It's not so simple. It is a long and complex ritual. And to do it, you must have certain rare ingredients. Nothing is impossible for me. I thought you already knew that. But then again, we only just met. Then get busy. Because in order to carry out the ritual of unfriendliness, you need a hair from magic's fur and a hair from flu.